Hi, in this video we'll look at how to tell whether eggshell remains that you find have been hatched or predated by another animal. So let's have a look at this eggshell down here. Now this is a wood pigeon egg and it's one of the ones you're most likely to come across when you're out and about in the British countryside. They're pure white and about four and a half centimetres long when they're intact. Now this is from a hatched egg rather than one that was eaten and we can tell this in several ways. So firstly it's been fairly neatly and evenly broken around the circumference at the thicker end of the egg. As the chick pecks its way out small fragments of shell come off but there's a tougher membrane inside that stays and this curls inwards as it dries out and you can often see they're sometimes pulling the edges of the shell inward slightly. Also we can't see any signs of yolk or blood inside the egg and you're quite likely to see that if the egg contents have been predated. Another clue here is that the top part of the shell has been pushed inside to the other half. You don't always see this but it's pretty common. Many birds get rid of eggshell remains from the nest to reduce the chances of attracting predators. So the parent bird will carry them away and drop them quite randomly. Predated eggs will vary depending on the predator. On this one here you can see a hole in one side. And some of the shell has been actually pushed inwards. Now this one, the predator was probably a, a crow or another corvid. Mammals such as pine martins also eat eggs. But with a lot of mammal predators, you're more likely to see puncture marks made by the canines. And these can be quite useful because you can use the distance between the canines to work out who the predator was. So thanks for watching and I hope this has been useful. And please subscribe below if you'd like to see more tracking videos. And happy tracking.